Hey everyone, it's Katara here. Today I'm going to be doing a haul for you guys, and it's not your typical haul. Well, I guess it kind of is. What is the definition of a haul? I don't, I don't even know, but I think this is a haul. I haven't done a haul video for you guys in a while, and I thought, why not do one now, since I just got some really cool stuff from this really cool website that I found. I'd seen it, like, being advertised all over my Facebook, like, saw like products and videos from people using some of their products all the time and I was like okay I'll check it out and one of the main reasons why I went to this website and by the way this website is called Memebox it's called Memebox.com and it's super awesome um, but the main reason I went to check out Memebox.com was I had been seeing this bubble clay mask like just everywhere. Everyone was so obsessed with this bubble clay mask and I was like I want to try it because it looks so much fun and I like masks. I like, I like a lot. I like them a lot. So I went and I actually found like this website is really cool. By the way, not sponsored at all. I'm not being paid to say this. I just really genuinely like them. But they have some really cool products for like very cheap like way cheaper than you expect like they're really cheap and you'll see with some of the products that I have a plus but I got five things from Meanbox and it didn't really take that long for them to get here I want to say it took maybe like three or four days I was thinking maybe around like seven days but it was like three or four I think so it was pretty fast I was very very um pleased with the shipping so let's get right into the Meanbox haul but the first thing that caught my eye when I went and checked out Meanbox.com with this was this brush. It's called the um I think it was called the I'm Core brush. Yeah, the Yeah. It's the dual pore brush. And it's the I'm brush. And I thought it was really cool. It looked cool. It's got like this part right here that's for like washing your face and this part that's like silicone little I don't know what you would call that little I don't know little silicone things but it's for like your pores or anything and I've used it a few times and by the way this brush part is like super soft like I'm obsessed like it's so soft and like it makes the lather of any like cleanser that you use like times a thousand like the foam the lather with this is like insane but this part I wasn't like completely like satisfied with this part because it doesn't really do much they're really like soft like silicone bristles bristles that's a good word for it right and I thought they were gonna be a little maybe just a little bit like harder because I mean the pore area you know I don't know maybe like it's supposed to be like this I don't know but it is nice for what it does and this brush was nine dollars so I was like okay I can't pass that up nine dollars for a face brush like that's pretty nice so I had to get this the next thing I got was this facial cleanser and it's the Aqua Berry Cleansing Foam and by the way like I'm pretty sure like all of the products that I got or that you get from Meanbox like they're all like the directions and stuff were written in like Japanese so they're, they're pretty I mean you know how to use like facial cleanser like everyone knows how to do that but I do like this it's really um it does it does really cleanse it gets a lot of my makeup off like without having to like take a makeup wipe and wipe and wipe get a makeup wipe can I get a makeup wipe without having to get a makeup wipe to get the rest of it off it does um, a really good job of getting most of the makeup off um, I do have to go back around like kind of my eyes where uh, there's still some mascara like somewhere because I don't really want to get it too much around my eyes but this smells so amazing I think I just got it on my nose but it smells so good it doesn't really smell like berries but it smells like so nice I, I like this a lot um will I repurchase it probably not and when I say that like I may not repurchase it, it doesn't necessarily mean that I don't like it but if I do repurchase something it means like I'm totally absolutely 100% in love with it so I'm not completely in love with this but I do like it but I won't be repurchasing it most likely just because I like trying new things and seeing if I can find something that is better than the last product I tried. The next thing I got is this mask and this is the white hydrating charcoal mineral mask. I'm really excited to use this because I saw a lot of reviews that said this was good for like if you have like really noticeable pores which I do especially around my nose area and so I'm really excited to try this 
was like 250. 250, you guys. 250. Like, that is insane. Insane. I also got another mask. Um, I got this mask and the other mask that I'm going to tell you guys about. Um, just because with the rest of the stuff, I was only $4 short from free shipping. So, I had to add some more stuff. But I still am really excited for this one. For this mask. And the other mask, I already kind of used a few nights ago before I made this video. Um, only because it sounded so weird and I just had to try it. It was a like some kind of snail mask. I'm not exactly sure what it's called. If I can find like a picture of it or something, I'll put it right here. If not, I'll probably put the link down to it and it was into the description below because it was just so weird. Um, but it was like a snail mask. Now I'm not completely sure if it had actually like snail slime or whatever in it I don't know what, what how that works how like snail I don't I have no idea but um I used it and it's a sheet mask so um so it was cool I like sheet masks but like the when you take it out of the package it's so slippery like I dropped it like three times before I could actually get it on my face to stay like it was so slippery but afterwards my skin felt like super smooth so it was nice it, I don't think it did anything like pore wise or like if it affected my oiliness I don't know but my skin was really smooth af afterwards so it was pretty cool and the thing that I went to Mean Box to find I got and it's the Eliza Becca Milky Piggy Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask I was so excited to try this I had to try it the day that my shipment came I just absolutely had to it comes in this really cute box it's got a cute little piggy with a mask on it's so cute and once again everything is in Japanese which is totally okay because I mean with most of these things you already know how to use them so it's like totally okay anyway this is a little jar that it comes in and it's so cute and then when you take the cap off it comes with um, a little spatula so you don't have to actually put your fingers into the mask to contaminate or get any germs in there or bacteria so this is really handy a lot of masks don't do this and I think they totally should because it's a really good idea and it's got this little top on because I don't think it's supposed to be um in the air because that's like how it activates so I don't think it's supposed to be um in the air too long but I'll take it off to show you guys I can't like that it smells familiar but I can't for the life of me put my finger on what it smells like it doesn't smell bad but um I wouldn't buy a perfume version of it if you know what I mean but it's super cool I used it and um I watched a lot of reviews on this mask just to kind of see like how it worked and to get a feel of what I was getting myself into when I bought this and um a lot of people said that it made their skin itch not because it was like irritating their skin or anything just because of it bubbling up and the foam bubbles um tickled and it made their skin itch um and it kind of did that a little only around my nose is where it itched just a little bit but it wasn't like too bad so it was totally bearable um, the bubbling on my face did tickle though. I will not deny that. It tickled a lot and I found myself like just going, ah, it tickled. I don't know what to do. But I left it on for five minutes and, um, and while like the mask itself is really fun and everything and afterwards you like rub it in to get better effects and I did that and like it feels good while it's on because I mean it's it's weird it's fun your face looks weird and and it's a fun mask and everything um and I'll use it again obviously because I bought it and I and I did like it but the downside to this is I don't think it did anything or benefited my skin at all after I took it off my skin I mean I guess it felt a little soft but my skin always kind of feels soft after I like take all my makeup off and um, cleanse it and everything so I'm not really sure if um, if that was the cause of my skin feeling smooth or if it was just you know how my skin usually is after I take off my makeup so that is one thing that I don't really like about this my my pores look the same noticeable and ugly um, my skin was still oily so I don't know if this really did anything. Also, I heard that this is good for blackheads. And I do have blackheads on my nose. Like, just, like, around here on my nose. And 
um, I didn't see any difference in those. I didn't see that it took any of them out or anything. So again, I like this just because it's fun, but it doesn't do anything for my skin. Again, I'll say that, I, pr I probably say that in all my videos where I'm talking about like skincare products or makeup or anything. I'm just like, it didn't do very well with my skin, but that completely doesn't mean that it can't do um, something different on your skin or someone else's skin because everyone's skin is different. Everyone's skin um, reacts differently to different products. So this could totally work for you and it could just make your skin feel like a baby's butt and it look flawless. I don't know. So you can definitely try it out. Um, I don't want this to like scare you or anything from trying anything. I just didn't like it personally because it didn't do much for my skin so I won't be repurchasing this one but I definitely will be repurchasing products from Meanbox.com just because they're super cool and they've got so many so many amazing products that sound like they like just do wonders for your skin that are really really affordable so I definitely recommend you guys checking out meanbox.com I'll put the link down to the website in the description below so you guys can check out all of their stuff because they're seriously amazing but there you go thank you guys so much for watching my Meanbox haul I'm super excited to try that other mask and like I said before, the meanbox.com link will be down in the description below. Or if you just want to type it in yourself, that's really cool. It's just meanbox.com and it's super awesome. Um, they've got lots of cool products that are super affordable. Um, and that says a lot for me because I'm, I'm cheap. I'll admit it. I am very cheap. But thank you guys for watching. All my social media links are down in the description below as well. So you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram. And you can add me on Snapchat. Because everyone loves Snapchat, right? Just me? No, everyone loves Snapchat. That's just... It's a fact, you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget, I put up new videos every Wednesday here on my channel. So don't forget to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button down below should totally click it because it's like free. I'll see you guys next Wednesday with a brand new video. Bye!